Ninjap provides the kind of um, ability and the process for Honey Gratine to uh, take back some of the land management practices that are currently still governed under the Indian Act for our reserve land territory within Honey Gratine. The main idea is that we are able to set out our, to use that tool that the Western world understands to express what we want to happen with our land, with our territory, and to take back the control of what that is. It's our land. Like we, we've been here, we've been here to protect it. Our ancestors have fought and have done many things to make sure that this land is here and is still in the pristine and um, untouched like way it is. Like we got to put a governance system in place, policies and all that, and how to use the land. It'll help us put in a system where we can always protect the land. Our Tsekhotin law has been in place long before us. And every law that we create has got to complement that Tsekhotin law. It can't be contrary to the Tsekhotin law. It allows us um, in the process of Nancha to create like some policies and some frameworks and some processes as well as like a, a lands and resources department uh, in order to do the work that you know the land management um, requires us to do as caretakers of the land. In this instance we don't have to follow the Indian Act and in this instance we don't have to follow what has been given to us by a colonial government and instead we can do and say what we feel fits for that portion of the land. And Nencha only deals with the land management structure on reserve lands. So it's only dealing with the portions of the Indian Act that are related to lands management on um, you know, what colonial governments called reserve lands. And because of that, it doesn't um, address or implicate or affect any other portions of the Indian Act. On May 8th and 9th, 2024, there'll be a referendum for the Hanigutin members. Before that, leading up to it from March to April, um, the Nanja team will be meeting with members from the Hanigutin um, in Prince George, Williams Lake, Honey, Kamloops and Vancouver. This is your decision. You decide how you want to protect yourself. Regardless of, you know, whatever the outcome is and what community decides on Nancha, um, this process in our developmental phase has provided us with, you know, resources to understand um, what land management could look like and examples from other First Nations communities who are involved in the process. We should live in harmony with the land and the animals. We have to look after it. This land vote, as you call it, is important to all of us.